You know what? I thought about it. No, I'm not going to prep my nails because I need to do the fake nails first. <laughs> under ten dollars Amazon and it's called a nail stand they have rubber ones this is magnetic that's why I like it and then you can take it off so if I wanna you know just work on one nail blah 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 you know you get the gist look look at the other video if you wanna <laughs> get all that and then I choose what nail I usually want I have right now I only have ones that's Stiletto that's clear and was it ballerina? I think it's a ballerina shape that's clear. And the ones I got from Sally's, I don't like them that much because they don't fit my nail beds. Like, I usually have to get a bigger size than I usually put on that, whatever particular nail, and then file it to fit my nail bed. I'm gonna show you. I feel like I'm working. So this is the EC basket by Nails Gaga. I am damn near out. Cause everybody know I like the cat nails and I like the cat eye. And I'm almost out. And these are the other ones because I was like, okay, they're shorter. This is, oh it says on here coffin. And then the natural color. I got this from Sally's. So the e-basket, Amazon, $7.99. And this is like around the same price too at Sally's. And I'm gonna buy these two because I like these. I can't, Lord. Okay. And of course you see the numbers. Sally's. So they're the short ones and I need Just an example, the way it's shaped at the end, ugh, I need like a, I get a book. The way it's shaped, you know, this part, like that's not how my nail bed is. Like if you can see it, it's, you know, more oval. It's not like wide and fat and end. So I usually have to file it, you know, but I don't think I'm going to do these. These ones I also got off of Amazon, but they came in a bag instead of a little case. Beauty and Salon Nail Art by Margaret. Made in China, of course. Amazon. Oh, I got the website for that. I like these two because it's a lot. Let's just offset that. Use a book to offset. And the website is on the back. Okay. The Amazon website to get these. Okay. So, I usually use one of those three. And these are clear too. So, after I figure out what nails is five minutes in, after I figure out what nails I want. Shit. After I figure out what nails I want and what shape I'm going to do to them. I get the nails, size my fingers, and then we start. I, since I've been doing my nails for a little bit, I kind of know what my, the numbers on my nails for the fake nails now. So this is more, it depends on the nail shape. This is like a zero or a one. These two are three. This is a two, I'm not trying to put my middle finger up. <laughs> this is a two. And this is like either a six or a seven. Ain't that crazy? <laughs> I 
I know it's like doing my nails. <laughs> so let's get started. Okay, welcome back, YouTube family. I'm trying to remember to look in the camera. In the camera. Stutter at myself. So again. Whoop. Hello, YouTube family. And the magic from TV land. I have now prepped the fake nails. So as you can see, I have, hold on, get my book. I prepped the nails and put them on the stand. Now, I cut them a little bit shorter. I work on the computer, and it's just me having this much space from the keyboard. It's just annoying. So, I cut them down just a tad. Um, so, the blue stuff that you see is the lock tape. That's what that is. Got that off of Amazon. Pretty sure you can get that from anywhere. Huh. So what I did was, ooh, I'm sorry. So what I did, I clipped them down and then I filed them down and I did it to the other five nails so they could all be the same length. Okay. Now, my choice of nail polish today, I think both are by Sinful Color. These are like $2 each. Okay, so this Sinful Color is called Aber Abergen. And this one is called Pinky Glitter. Okay, put some extra decoration. Yay. And I told y'all all this before I got this stuff off of Amazon. My daughter's hilarious. She's like, sorry for interrupting on your video. <laughs> yeah. So anyway, <laughs> what was I saying? Yes, the jelly nail polish that I said was small in the other video, and I had to buy another one, and it's gel. Yeah, you sit it like there. Yeah. I'm closing the door because they're loud, and I'm trying to not have that in my background. Here you go, no, come on. I said, I'm not trying to make you. Just leave it there because you're not, you want to go fall on your head. Yeah. You ain't that, you're not that tall yet. Jaden, go do what you're supposed to be doing. You can do all that, but that's getting cut out. So, <laughs> I don't know why you're going on it. Okay, I had a solid five to seven minutes of interruptions. I don't know where the heck I left off. I'm gonna start with nail polish. Okay, Beck. <laughs> so, the gel and polish, which I also, the gel and polish, which I also purchased off of Amazon, which is a top coat and base coat. Um, it's a little small, it's a little compact. This is the box. I mean, I have big hands, but still, this is. This, this baby is small. It's small. So, just imagine the top coat ooh, I mean, <laughs> and base coat. Even smaller, right? Little bottles compared to a regular nail polish bottle like this. So the regular bottle, how many ounces? 0.5 ounces. This is eight milliliters. Okay, so yeah. So I was like, ah. I didn't read the reviews or nothing to see how, you know. So the, I know you guys can't feel it, but it's, it's loose. I used it a lot. And the base coat, I don't think I used this but one time. But it was under $10 for both. But still, I mean, who's using this little kid? I don't know. So, I really wanted to talk about, which I got today from, guess what? Amazon. Was I bought another top coat. Different brand, not gelling. It's Beatles. What is it? Beatleys. And it is 
0.51 fluid ounce equal to 15 milliliters, which is more, you know, more the size. This is the, the gel top coat, and this is the regular polish. Oh, again, the nail colors are regular polish. They're not gel polish whatsoever. I got this because I go to, when I was going to the salon to get my nails done, I would get the regular polish with the, well, no, I wouldn't get the regular polish with other. I think I just made that up. Because I didn't feel like buying gel polish. I don't know. The gel polish, I can't find any that I really like that's gel. So I've been, what I've been doing, regular polish with a gel top coat. And it's worked for me. Still come out good. So, this is again by Beatley's. I think it was five something. So that's a good amount compared to my little baby bottle. <laughs> from gelling not the same thing it did what it needs to do but <laughs> my but what i do find with the fake nails that i'm using out of the package i would use the regular top coats that you would do with the nails but i found that gel polish makes that nail stronger because these nails are they're flimsy you know, they're really flimsy. So to add more strength, so if I'm, you know, poking something, because my nails that I do are long, so I'm poking something, it's not like bending, you know, that much. It just gives it a little bit more support, you know. It makes it a little stronger to so the gel polish. So I recommend using gel polish, and but mostly I recommend using gel top coat because it strengthens it. So moving along, I'm going to paint a couple of nails, come back, regroup, and then show you how the top coat looks, the gel top coat, because that's what I really want to see, because I've never used this product before, so I don't know how it's going to look. So, I'm coming back. Uh, the pink coming in a little bit. I don't think I'll do another coat for the this uh I don't even know it's like a purple deep plum color. I don't think like how it transfers it looks lighter but it's it's a dark color. But I'm gonna do a couple more swipes of this pink so it can come through more pink for the sparkle pink pink. But it came through with the second coat. It probably comes through more with another. One more. So I finished the nails. I was going to put the application of me putting them on. But I mean. Seriously. It's really just glue. Put the nail on. It was like I said. I paint them. All that pretty. Fall color. Like a deep plum. Painted them all. Besides the ring finger, the ring finger, I painted this pretty, what's it called? Pink glitter, which is definitely pink glitter. And topped it off with the beatless top coats. And the top coat was good. It's nice and shiny. Didn't take that long to cure. So just an FYI, in case you didn't watch the other video, once again, referencing the stuff I got from Amazon. I have a gelling, ooh, Jesus. I have a gelling UV light lamp, whatever you call it. I love it. It was definitely under $20, so you can, it has a sensor. So once your hand is underneath of there, it'll start, you know, going. This is a good price. Buy gelling under $20. So I did that. And these are the nails. Let me do my book. And then I think I'll do a quick look with them actually on my hands. Hello, YouTube people. I wanted to get back to you guys. This is the day after and I finished my nails, as you can see. So I just wanted to showcase. I put a little flip at the end, but whatever. So anyway, back to the nails. So... The nails, 
This little one looks a little bit more pink, oddly. And again, this is the gel top coat by Beat Beatleys. And oh, some I put a little foil on the end so my fingers can be like that. I glued them on. Oh, I can show you the glue. This is the glue that I get from Sally's. I love this glue. This glue is very strong. It's under $5. So that is it. So there they are. So that's that pink glitter, glittery color. I'm gonna know how many coats I put. I think I put two coats for this. I kind of had to put a few more coats to kind of get the pink. And this one, I don't know why you can't see the pink that much, but this one you see the pink more. Alright, I'm done. Goodbye. So, thank you guys for watching another video. For me, Danielle, I am not going to sit in here and tell you lies and say I'm going to try to be more consistent because, again, it will be lies. I'm going to try. Is it going to happen? I don't know. <laughs> again, work life. I work 40 hours a week. I have two kids. I'm tired. I'm going to go sleep now. I want to come in and go to sleep, but I'm like, homework, dinner doing these nails and doing this video so a whole other job when I came home after the 30 to 45 minute drive because I, I mean I'm a little too far away but traffic sucks all right guys good night good morning good afternoon wherever you are in the world thank you so much for spending your time with me Danielle and I catch you on the next